In this video demonstration, we will see about a differential bacterial staining technique. The acid fast staining. This protocol is used to differentiate and to identify the acid fast bacterial organisms. The differential bacterial staining technique. This is used to differentiate the bacterial organisms. The gram staining and the acid fast staining are the differential bacterial staining techniques. The gram staining differentiate the bacteria into the gram positive and the gram negative bacteria. In the previous video demonstration, we have discussed about the gram staining technique. The link is available in the below YouTube description. Next, the acid fast staining, which differentiate the bacteria into the acid fast and the non acid fast bacteria. The acid fast staining. This technique was first introduced by Paul Ehrlich. Later, it was modified by the two German doctors, the bacteriologist, Franz Ziel, and the pathologist, Friedrich Nielsen. So, this method is also popularly well known as Ziel Nielsen's technique. This is a differential bacterial staining method. Here, more than one stain is used. This technique is used to differentiate and classify the bacterial organisms into two groups the acid fast bacteria and the non acid fast bacteria. Our interest is to identify the acid fast bacteria. The very good example of an acid fast bacterium is Mycobacterium species, which is the causative agent of the tuberculosis, the TB, in humans and animals, and the causative agent of the para tuberculosis in animals. Certain bacteria, on application of the carbofuchsin staining solution, they can easily take up the stain to their cell surface. Next, on application of the decolorizing agent, the acid alcohol, they can be easily get decolorized and leaving the bacteria colorless. On contrast, certain bacteria, on application of the carbofuchsin staining solution, they are difficult to stain. But once they take up the stain, further on application of the decolorizing agent, the acid alcohol, they are not decolorized, and leaving the bacteria to stain pink. Such type of bacteria are called as the acid fast bacteria. The other group of bacteria, which get easily decolorized with acid alcohol, are called as the non acid fast bacteria. The very good example of an acid fast bacterium is mycobacterium. These mycobacteria are slender rods. The surface of this mycobacterium consists of a lipoidal wall called as mycolic acid, which is a waxy material over the mycobacterial surface. So, because of this lipoidal wall, these bacteria, on application of carbofuchsin staining solution, they are difficult to stain. But, along with the continuous heat treatment, they take up the stain by passing through this lipoidal wall. Further, on application of the acid alcohol, the decolorizing agent, they are not decolorized and leaving the bacteria to stain pink. This is called as the acid fastness. Such type of bacteria are called as the acid fast bacteria. In general, this acid fast bacteria cannot be stained easily. However, once stained, it cannot be de stained. This acid fast bacteria are generally arranged in bundles. This is due to the presence of the waxy material, the mycolic acid, over the mycobacterial surface. Ultimately, this gives a bundle of faggot arrangement. This is the bundle of faggot. The mycobacterium will have this type of arrangement. So, the arrangement of the acid fast bacteria is called as bundle of faggot arrangement. Coming to the principle behind the acid fast staining technique. This technique differentiate the bacteria based on their coloring property. Therefore, we will discuss their coloring property of the acid fast and the non acid fast bacteria in parallel to each other. Once the bacteria are treated with the strong carbofuchsin, which is the primary stain used here, along with the heat treatment, it gives a pink color to both the bacteria, but only 
the acid fast bacterium, fixes the primary stain. Next, when, the acid alcohol is added, this is the decolorizer. It decolorizes, the primary stain, easily from, the non-acid fast bacteria. But, the acid fast bacteria, retains, the primary stain. Lastly, on use of, the counter stain, the Leffler's methyl and blue, that gives, blue color, to the non-acid fast bacteria, and to the background. So, on acid fast staining, the non-acid fast bacteria in the background, appears blue, and, the acid fast bacteria, appears pink. This color difference is due to, their difference, in their cell wall constituents. The surface of, the acid fast bacteria, consists of, lipoidal wall, called, the mycolic acid, which is a waxy material, over the mycobacterial surface. But, this waxy material, is not present over, the non-acid fast bacteria. So, on microscopic examination, the background appears, blue, and, the acid fast bacteria stains, pink. But, on use of, the counter stain, the malachite green staining solution, that gives, green color, to the non-acid fast bacteria, and to the background. In that case, on microscopy, the background appears, green, and, the acid fast bacteria stains, pink. The demonstration. The procedure for, the acid fast staining technique. The materials, required are, the strong carbyl fuchsin staining solution, which is used as a primary stain, in this experiment. The acid alcohol, used as a decolorizer. This is prepared by using 3% hydrochloric acid and 95% alcohol. And, the Leffler's methylene blue staining solution, which is used as a counter stain, in this experiment. These are, the three important solutions, required for conducting, the acid fast staining technique. Apart from this, the other requirements are, the forceps, the blotting paper, the spirit lamp, the distilled water, and, the smear, prepared from the sample, which is, air dried and heat fixed. And lastly, the staining rack. These are, the requirements, for conducting, the acid fast staining procedure. First, prepare the smear, from sample. Spread the smear, to the size, of about, 1 cm square, so as, to form, a thin, film. After spreading, allow it, to air dry. It may take, 2-3 to three minutes, for drying. After air drying, fix the smear, by heat, by passing over the flame, 2-3 to three times, with, a slow sweeping motion. This is called, heat fixation of smear. After, the preparation of smear, place the fixed smear, on the staining rack. Then, ignite, the spirit lamp. First, add, the strong carbyl fuchs and staining solution, over the smear. Cover, the entire smear with, the staining solution. Heat the stain until vapor just begins to rise. Do not overheat. Allow the heated stain to remain on the slide for 8 minutes. Great care must be taken when heating the carbyl fuchsin. Only a small flame should be applied under the slides using an ignited spirit lamp. After 8 minutes, allow the slide to cool down. And then, wash it with, the distilled water. Secondly, add, the acid alcohol, the decolorizer, over the smear, cover, the entire smear with, the acid alcohol. And, allow it, to act for, 2 minutes or until the smear is sufficiently decolorized to pale pink. After 2 minutes, wash it with, the distilled water. Lastly, add, the Leffler's methylene blue staining solution, over the smear. Cover, the entire smear with, the staining solution. And, allow it, to stand for, 30 seconds to 1 minute. After 30 seconds to 1 minute, wash it with, the distilled water. After washing, blot dry, the smear, using, the blotting paper. 
Now, the stain smear is ready for the microscopic examination. The microscopic examination. Place the stain slide over the stage. Examine the slide under 100x oil immersion objective microscopy on microscopic examination. Following the acid fast staining technique, these acid fast bacteria are stained pink, which are slender rods, and they are arranged in bundle of faggot arrangement. Due to the methylene blue counter stain, the background is stained blue. This background gives a good contrast for the acid fast bacteria in pink. So, the result is written as the smear prepared from the sample stained using the acid fast staining technique is positive for the acid fast bacteria with the bundle of faggot arrangement the example of bacteria is the mycobacterium species which posses this type of microscopic feature on acid fast staining technique coming to the summary of the acid fast staining technique first the preparation of the smear from the sample after smear preparation air dry and heat fix the smear after fixation Add, the strong carbol fuchs and staining solution, over the smear. Heat the smear, with the staining solution, for 8 minutes. After 8 minutes, allow the slide, to cool down. And then, wash it with, the distilled water. Next, add, the decolorizer, the acid alcohol, over the smear. Allow it, to act for, 2 minutes, or, until the smear is, sufficiently decolorized, to, pale pink. After the smear is, sufficiently decolorized, wash it with, the distilled water. Lastly, add, the counter stain, the Leffler's methylene blue staining solution, over the smear. Allow it, to stand for, 30 seconds to 1 minute. After 30 seconds to 1 minute, wash it with, the distilled water. After washing, blot dry, the smear, using, the blotting paper. Now, the stained smear, is ready, for, the microscopic examination. Place, the stain slide, over the stage. Examine the slide, under, 100x, oil immersion, objective microscopy. With this, we are coming to the end of, the acid fast staining technique. The detailed protocol for the acid fast staining technique, is available as, downloadable link, in the below YouTube description. In next video demonstration, we will see about, the Leishman staining technique, which is a blood smear staining technique. Hope the lecture is, informative, and useful. Thank you.